Hi, what's up? How are you? Hi, Arundhati. I'm good. Thank you. Thank you for having me. Yes, I mean, it was such a, you know, interesting conversation that I wanted to have with you because, uh, okay, so I would like to start it from there. You know, I was in the theater. Uh, I was watching this film called uh, Maricom. And there's this one scene, okay, uh, where mm. you uh, first, uh, you know, Priyanka, Priyanka Chopra, who played the Maricom, uh, the character, uh, the celebrated right. boxer. And there she is having an argument with uh, the, the sports counselor or uh, somebody from the sports uh, official. And right. there uh, she's having the argument and there you come in and say that, ha ha, or maybe ja ke bolungi ki tu raat ko phone pe is tera wo jo hai, wo phone pe raat ko tere saath kya baat karta hai. And all of that and I'm like, oh, oh my God, she's kind of an angry one, ha. Uh-huh. Here, here uh, comes my question, which is uh, the very important uh, you know, point of our conversation. And that is the attitude that I saw in you the fire that i saw in you in that particular scene the scene that i re- referred to uh, right. when when uh, after that uh, every time when you have gone for any audition and you right. were stereotyped and rejected because of the very fact that you look in a certain way uh, tell Definitely. me why why did you not use that fire to punch them and saying that hey listen why don't you write a character who is coming from Northeast instead of asking yeah. <laughs> me to, you know, go, uh, pack my bag and go back to Manipur? Like, why? Definitely, it's, uh, it requires a lot of patience, a lot of, you know, uh, perseverance to be an actor, especially like, you know, I mean, I have had, uh, you know, a lot of times where I felt like packing my bags and just switching my, you know, profession to, uh, I mean, a lot of time in life. So being passion and, you know, it's like, you know, at at some point, you know, also you become like a Zen, you start thinking like, you know, it's, it's sad that we have to do that. We have to go through that. You know, if you are in a job, like, uh, like, you know, a simple job where you think that you put in your hard work and you put in your energy into it and, you know, you learn about it, do so much about it and you automatically are, you're ought to get uh, you know, a result. But idhar kya hai ki, like, you know, jitna bhi dale jao, like my colleagues have, are doing so well, you know, they're doing big projects and they're discussing about uh, above struggles and, you know, about ki, achha, ye, women ko, ko, aise role kyun nahi diya jata, you know, they have reached that stage of conversation where I am still struggling, where the conversation is like, why am I not still accepted after 10 years of being in the industry? Because uh, on date pe, regional industry se bhi bahut sare cross region industry se celebrated actors are getting opportunity right. especially from the south indian film industry mm-hmm. as well as from the punjabi film industry but when True. it comes to the north northeastern film industry it is is it isn't it also the tough call for a producer to take when it comes to they are taking a uh, northeastern uh, a, a girl who looks or comes from a girl or a guy, like looks from, looks like somebody coming from the northeast and mm-hmm. with a certain feature, and mm-hmm. that is why they think twice. Like, have you have you try and analyze from their perspective as well? I can ask the same thing, right? Uh, it's like when there is a film made on. See, first of all, we are minorities. Ek to ye cheez hai ki hum minorities hai. So our appearances, our, our looks are different from, uh, you know, the rest of the India. Uh, uh, so the whole fight is about inclusivity, right? Sure. So n- not me featuring, not me as playing uh, Kashmiri, but then ideal, if somebody is making a film on Kashmir, they should ideally cast a Kashmiri actor, right? Or sure. a not not Indian closest would be so just like that. If you can add, uh, you know, authenticity to your project. So, आपने जो question पूछा है, why not? Like, you know, I'm just an actor. Why not ask this to, uh, you know, like if I start thinking, why aren't they doing justice to, uh, you know, is this justified? एक तो पहले तो एक let's let's get to this कि मुझे consider ही नहीं किया जाता है. <laughs> so, how will I think about what they're thinking? 
but what we what we need to focus is to bring in inclusivity because india is vast we have varieties of like you know we have many languages many cultures so, many you know different looking people the north and east the, the south you know the the west like you know all three are like uh, like all of this are very very different from the heartbreaking thing that you have come across uh, from those people who are so called uh, global citizen or who believe that uh, new york is our neighboring state instead of northeast <laughs> there are many many incidents that uh you know it will go on our interview will not finish if i start uh, uh you know Narrative mentioning them incident. yeah Narrative so uh incident. the biggest disappointment comes from the most educated people if it happens in a systematic way of being racist like you know you're sitting in a ac room you're working you know you know you have the luxury to understand these cultures and you know uh, and whatever uh, so, uh, you know what you think that is not important is important to ye jo sari baatein jab ek educated person ke muh se nikalte hain then it's very disappointing you know you making remarks which you are not supposed to be what is your education for actual racism can lead to harassment can lead to a rape can lead to you know uh, you yeah, know some of these life the even yeah. uh, you know some of uh our uh you know people have died because we look different in delhi so this is a very serious case and if you can't understand if you don't understand but these same people they talk about uh equality for uh, black uh community in america they will hashtag that black lives matter but none of these people because they're trending right we need trends to you know a hashtag that trends to for them to uh, bring their awareness but when it comes to their own people their own uh, you know uh, culture they completely take a blind side and they can ignore completely like when all this was happening during last year pandemic and lockdown uh, even the black lives matter was happening i saw so many celebrities were talking about uh, how um, african americans lives matter when their own brothers and sisters in india belonging to the same land are getting harassed none of this was spoken but they were talking about america so what you just said like you know they think new york is their neighboring state so this is the sad part that we live in and we are going to so you you correctly mentioned that in the beginning of the conversation and this is the saddest part and it comes from the most educated people think like you know how we can change i mean of course we are constantly talking uh, of course we are uh, we are constant uh, like uh, especially people who you know kind of you know trying to incorporate these things and uh, do you think tokenism is one of the things that also needs to stop so um very first fact is to uh, bring awareness and treat us as normal as you would treat a gujarati a punjabi uh, you know a bengali or anybody you know not treat us differently uh, i mean not find us like oh like you know acha wo to uska ang choti hai you know acha theek hai aap not is se we don't want that pity party you know we really don't need that as as much as people can you know by just talking about oh you know ek interview kiya fir like you know people will read that interview and it the chapter is closed no you know taking a step forward like you know literally if you mean something not just being an ornamentally going to manipur or nagaland and shooting you know uh, and just like you know the visuals no you know include people from there make them part of your projects right. you know it's a it's a request to all these writers and directors and studios why not involve us if you're making a But... film about Hmm. Yeah, yes. I, 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 I want to, I want to, I want to butt in here because I was just thinking that you know when you were talking about it, I understand. See, women are telling women's story, and there, that is how the the whole movement in in last five ten years, the way right. it has happened, where there are so many female uh, filmmakers are telling mm-hmm. female stories, and therefore there are so many female centric stories. Do you think we need more number of? Uh, Film directors and producers coming from northeast uh, to uh, say Hindi film industry 
uh, and making the film telling their story in their own ways there and only then probably the story that you actually think should be told right. can only uh, be possible yeah definitely like how feminism the topic has come up in such a uh, you know a stronger way and people are supporting female writers female directors dops like that it's as simple as that like you know taking out so my our film akuni was one uh, conversation starter which happened yes. last year which was released last year so yes. that is somewhere uh, you know a lot of people started noticing that oh you know it could be me there are actors from the north is there are writers and directors and dops and so forth and so on so there are people from there who can make a full fledged film so a lot of time arundhati what happens is also lack of awareness uh, we are not well aware well informed about our own culture our own states you know so this is where it leads to and uh, you know this is where it starts you know it doesn't just happen you know it does just yeah. doesn't happen a violence you know on the road it happens deep rooted people think that we are uh, you know i was called coronavirus throughout the pandemic like you know i was people were following me all of that yeah there are a lot of things that goes on in some like you know in our lives but where does this all uh, you know sprout from ignorance mm-hmm.